Switching things over to the Little Diamond. Now, ever since the formation of the NEA, the Leo softball team has dominated the conference. The Lions have won at least a share of the conference title in four of the five seasons. Today, they had a chance to wrap up a fourth overall and second straight outright conference crown hosting DeKalb. But the Barons, they were looking to spoil the party early. Top one, Brenna Spangler lines a single into left field. That plates Katie Waters from second. DeKalb takes a 1-0 lead, but Leo, hey, they would respond in a big way in the bottom half of the frame. Wild pitch that allows Sydney Tackett to trot home with ease. Ties the game at one apiece. But the Lions, hey, they were just getting started. Later on, up four, Leah May says, let's make it six. She takes a ball into left, two runs score, but waits. There's more. Still in the first, Eden Roberts at the dish. She goes oppo taco. Two more runs come home on her RBI double, makes it 13 to one Leo. And then next batter, Lillian Reeser at the dish now. She lines a shot into left. That brings Roberts in to score. Leo puts up a 15 spot. Talk about a crooked number in the bottom of the first inning alone. And while it was all curtains from there, Lions win 21-1 in five. They claim their second straight NE8 title. It's a great feeling, honestly. I've been on this team for four years now, and it doesn't get better than that. It's real easy to come out here and win when you play as a family and you get along with each other. It's just a great team. And these girls get along really. Oh, man, that's cool. <laughs> they get along really well together, and you can see how much fun they have. Uh, that's the second one of those this year. Um, it feels good, um, but yeah, I mean, the hard work that they put in the off season and, you know, all the work that they do when we're not looking, um, but they work just as hard when we're around and it's just really good to see. The Lions, they're now 22 and two on the year and they're going to wrap up their season with three non-conference games at the end of this week.